an application letter is a document that helps recruiters, money lenders, or employers to know more about the applicant. Therefore, for any purpose you can use an application letter for, it must be a most compelling one. So for this reason, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can draft a most compelling application letter that will help your application to be picked when you are applying for a student loan. So before we begin, let's take a short break. This is Sami's Network. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it's the first time coming to this YouTube channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like, comment, and share the video. So, without wasting any time, let's look at uh, how we can write the application letter when applying for a student loan. So, the, the first thing that you have to do uh, is to, to write your, your address. Your address must be on the top right. Top right. Uh, this address must uh, consist of uh, the name to which your the address is uh, subjected to. It must also contain the address. It must must also contain the the date. Then the second part of uh, the address is the the address of. Uh, the receiver the recipient so this is the address of uh, the chief executive officer the higher education loan and scholarship board if we check uh, our advert which was just released by the higher education board we can see that uh, uh, we were given instructions that uh, uh, this letter must be addressed to uh, the chief executive officer through these details which are here so you must not forget this always when you are writing make sure that you use a correct address for the recipient so after writing all the address the second thing that you have to do is to write the salutation that's a dear sir or madam so this salutation we use this salutation because we do not know who will attend to our application letter whether it's a madam or it's a sir we do not know so we just write dear sir or madam then the reference the reference uh, is where you specify the level of uh, a loan that you are requesting for so you would say application for 100 percent student loan if it's uh, 50 percent you indicate 50 percent if it's 70 percent you indicate depending on on your level of vulnerability so after writing the reference uh, the second the other thing that you have to do is the first paragraph this first paragraph must contain information about you who is uh, writing the application you must write uh, where you saw the advert if you remember on the advert, ad advert which was published they told us that uh, an application letter should be responding to the advert, meaning uh, the application letter must be subject to the advert. So in this case, you write where you saw the advert. So in this case, it was written that uh, following the advert which was published on the Higher Education Loans and Scholarship Board website for an open application session. I hereby write this letter to apply for a 100% student loan. So you have addressed, uh, you have written your first words to respond to uh, the advert which was just released. This is uh, very important because this, this is the first hand information that they will look at. So they will know that you saw the advert on the website. Then the second thing you now introduce yourself. I am a Zambian, either male or female, then you specify your age, if it's 22 years, 21, but don't forget that uh, the, the age which qualifies is 24 years and below, so it must not exceed this uh, range. So you specify when you completed your secondary school education, which year you completed. 
then you also specify the university that you've been admitted to so for this case since the advert is for unza you write i was just admit i was recently admitted at the university of zambia to pursue then you specify the the course that you'll be doing so you say bachelor of electrical and electronics in the school of engineering you specify that then you also say starting in the 2023 academic year in january yeah so this was all about the the first paragraph then the second paragraph this is a very important part of your application because this is where you specify or you state your level of vulnerability so here you say i'm applying for a loan because i'm coming from a background where we cannot afford to pay for the high fees and i'm a double orphan so mind you this information is just a sample you don't have to copy everything that i have written here but you can copy the format that i have used so you say double orphan if it's single orphan if you have both parents but they cannot afford you you just write that was raised by my grandmother who has been striving to pay my secondary fees despite of her health and has been providing through selling vegetables so you can see the words that this applicant used you can tell that this person is really vulnerable and they can the background where he's coming from they cannot af afford to pay for the high fees at Unza. so this is all about it the second paragraph then the last paragraph you you this last part you you just write how that as a, that uh, loan will benefit you if you are given that percentage which you have written if given this 100 percent loan it will help me to achieve my dreams of becoming an engineer or if it's a doctor if it's a teacher you specify and contribute to the growth of our country and also improve the status of our family welfare i have attached all my necessary documents as required and to support my vulnerability your consideration on this matter will be highly appreciated so that's all about the uh, writing this application letter. so it must be brief but straightforward make sure that you have the first paragraph you must uh, write it uh, it must be in subject to the advert which was released and also introduce yourself the second part you specify your level of vulnerability then the third part you write how you are going to benefit if you are given that loan so then the last part you you write your your name but you also sign at the middle of your name and this last word then when you reach at this stage you are done with your application so this this is all about how to draft an application letter when applying for a student loan so as the as indicated by the watermark here you can see this is just a sample don't use this information because it was just showing you how you need to write this so thank you very much for watching make sure that you subscribe to this channel so that i can be providing you with more information concerning this matter